Hey guys, Ben here, and welcome back to another video on The Flash Season 7. Today we're going to be talking about some exciting new piece of news regarding a returning character. So if you do go on to enjoy the video, please be sure to leave a like and a comment, and subscribe if you're new so you don't miss any DC TV videos later this year. Okay, so this is super exciting, this is coming from Pagey, and I think the original source was Wales Comic Con, they did a panel yesterday, it was a Flash panel, had the actor for Gorilla Grodd, and they had the actor for King Shark, along with one other very, very special guest, and that is, of course, Rick Cosnett. So, I'm sure you guys remember Rick. He played Eddie Thorne during season 1, he's returned a couple of times since, I believe he was in the Into the Speed Force episode where he just briefly cameoed, he had like a decently big role in that episode, although like a version of him never has returned, like Eddie Thorne is dead, so yeah, he played Eddie on the show, and although we haven't seen any alternate versions of Eddie, we've only seen the Speed Force embody Eddie, and that's where Rick returns. People have been theorizing for the longest time that Eddie is going to return. And so now we have some very, very exciting news. And that is because Rick Cosnett has said that he is definitely returning to The Flash before the series ends. With him adding that he hopes to return as Cobalt Blue. So now there's two big things here, right? Obviously, he's talking about the series ending, there's been rumours going around recently over the past like week or so that The Flash is ending with season 8. That has not been confirmed, please don't talk about it if you don't know, like, wait for the CW to say anything official. This is always just rumours and it doesn't help that it spreads around online because people get confused, people start asking questions that aren't even like being brought up by the CW themselves. So wait for an official announcement, and I don't think The Flash is going to be ending after Season 8, that is like my official statement on that, because oh my god, it's been going around so much this week and it's so annoying. But anyway, back to this. So Rick Cosnett has said that he is definitely returning to The Flash before the series ends. So with him saying definitely, this means he's 100% going to come back. I don't know if this means he's already talked about it with the showrunner Eric Wallace. It's very possible that that has happened because they're definitely planning season 8 because they're not going to have that much of a big break between season 7 and 8. So it's very likely that Eddie could return in season 8. And so how would Rick be coming back? Well, obviously they could revive the original Eddie who got killed at the end of season 1. However, I don't think that that's super likely. I think what's more likely that when he comes back, it's going to be an alternate version of Eddie from another Earth, kind of like what they're doing with Superman and Lois right now with Lex Luthor turning out to be someone completely different. So what happens if this is Eddie from another Earth, but this is Cobalt Blue Eddie, so he's going to turn out to be a villain, and with Rick actually acknowledging Cobalt Blue, that is super exciting because if there has been conversations, maybe that's been brought up, and that is definitely in the playing cards as of right now. Obviously, we've all theorized about it for a long time because we wanted Eddie to return in some form, and lots of us thought that Cobalt Blue would be a cool villain to introduce and a cool way for Rick to come back. And with him acknowledging that this is a way that he would like to come back, I don't see why it shouldn't happen. I think it's possible this could happen in Season 8. I'm not saying that's 100% going to be happening like I don't even know anything about him coming back he's just said he wants to return before the show ends he obviously doesn't know when the show ends because no one knows right now so this could mean that season 8 is not in the cards or it could mean season 8 is definitely going to happen for Rick coming back or it could be season 9 could be season 10 could be season 11 who knows when the show is actually going to end and when he's going to show up that remains a mystery. But it's just really nice that he has officially confirmed that he is 100% going to be returning before the show ends, and the fact that he knows of Cobalt Blue, he knows of fans' theories, and he thinks it's actually a good idea, and would probably recommend it if he's to actually return. So, all super exciting, I think this is great news for everyone, so let me know what do you think about all of this in the comments down below. But let's move on to our next thing. So we have this interview with Tom Kavanagh, and so the title of the article from Digital Spy is The Flash Star Wants to Return to the Show One Day Following the Exit. And so this was recently announced, Tom Kavanagh is leaving the show. About a month ago they said, along with the announcement that Carlos Valdez is leaving the show as well, that Tom isn't going to be around. 
However, recently we've seen that Tom actually returned to Vancouver to shoot the finale. He is going to be playing, spoiler alert, Reverse Flash in that finale episode, which is super exciting. He's going to be teaming up with Team Flash to take down Godspeed. I don't know the background about that, but that's really, really cool. Anyway, so past the finale, Tom Cavanaugh is going away. He's not going to be a series regular. However, he is very open to returning. And so now, TV Line, but I'm reading this through Digital Spy, has teased via Tom Cavanaugh's interview with them that he wants to return for a potential episode in the future. And so this is a quote. I'm not saying that this is going to happen, but Greg Belanti and I have always felt that when Grant Gustin decides to depart the show, it would be hard to imagine a scenario other than Batman comes home to Joker and Flash and Reverse Flash settle things, the actor said. And so it would be hard to imagine a different storyline, and that's all I'm going to say right now. And so this is him referring to wanting to come back. And in the TV line article, it says, you can probably expect a final encore when the superhero series wraps. This is what Tom Kavanagh told TV line. So this is basically him confirming that, yes, I'm totally open to come back and I want to come back, especially before the show ends. So obviously this is like a running common theme between these two interviews. That's why I paired them in this one video because they're saying, I want to return. However, I don't know when I'm going to return, but I want to come back before the show ends because I think it would be cool if I came back for like one or two appearances. And with Tom Kavanagh being Tom Kavanagh and being such a pivotal part of the show, he would know that fans want to see this. But also, I think he would want to go back to his Flash family that he's literally been living with in Vancouver and surrounded by for literally many years because Tom has always been a series regular on the show. And that means even when he's dipping in and out of Vancouver or not even shooting, he is pretty much around them all year long and has been since like 2014 when they started shooting and airing The Flash. So, you know, I think he is 100% down to come back and before the show ends, just like Rick Cosnett, he is going to return as Eobard Thorne or Harrison Wells. And so in addition to this, we have another interview from another past villain on the show. So literally everyone is coming out and being like, I want to return to The Flash. Like, make it happen. And so, in an interview with ComingSoon.net, Neil Sandlands, who played the Thinker in Season 4, was talking about returning to The Flash. Now, you guys know that I don't like The Thinker. I think he is definitely the worst villain on the show. However, I would be open to see any past faces return. It's always a nice surprise. And hopefully, they do a better job with his brief appearance when he comes back than they did with that whole season. No offense to Neil Sandlands. I think he's a good actor. However, I just did not like this character. And so this is part of his interview talking to ComingSoon.net about him returning to The Flash. So we kind of joked about a return happening. Eric Wallace and Todd Hell being the showrunners at the time, we talked about that. And so, you know, we were like, how can we make this happen? And I had a particularly pleasant time working with them. And we were thinking about ways to do that. They're delightful, a super talented writing team, and I'm sure they can come up with something. Then he goes on to say, I would imagine that either there would be something like in a prehistory or the idea of AI and where that is going. DeVoe, maybe he morphed into some form of artificial intelligence. That's a creative solution, but it would be grand and lovely to come back as DeVoe and shoot in Vancouver again. And so this kind of rings true with what's happened before in DC Comics. A lot of times when Brainiac, for instance, a very smart character, when he gets killed off, he always goes into AI, he goes into like computer systems, and he's basically immortal. So this would definitely be a very smart way of bringing Devo back rather than like strictly resurrecting him and his body. So I do like this idea and we'll have to wait and see if this all happens. But for now, thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. Please be sure to leave a like and a comment. Leaving that like really helps get the video out there. So thank you so much for that. But also if you're new, please be sure to subscribe and turn on notifications. And for now, you can all click on the top right corner of the screen to watch my latest video if you missed it, and I'll catch you guys later, goodbye.
Icy Road.